Hey guys, it's Mr. Dominari here, and we're back with another horror game. I haven't played a horror game in a little bit. I also haven't played an indie game in a little bit. I don't think it's going to take very long. Um, but I haven't done these little um, individual independent um, games in a long time, and I have missed it. I really, really missed it. Um, that's because mostly I've been working on Destiny content along with some different uh, projects in the background, which you'll probably hear about in a month or two. Um, as well as just some stuff with my friends like you might have seen on the channel, like um, Outlast. I'm also getting a bunch of some of the other old videos edited, like my old videos with Lacey, like how we have the streamer overload video of it. But that's neither here nor there. We're here to play the convenience store, which was part of this horror bundle. And it was the, I think it was a lot of, like the indie horror Masters or something like that? I don't know. It came with like four or five games that were just some really, really good indie horror games. And so I would love to give them a shot. Um, I don't know. Okay. You know what? Let's just get into it. I was going to say I, don't, I haven't really delved that deep into these horror type games. But <laughs> I guess today's a good as day as any. Oh, my God louder than I thought I was going to be. It's time. Need to get ready for work. Oh. Oh, I can see uh, my... Oh, I slept well. Rat Atui. I can see my convenience store from over there. Oh man, I I could use some Windex. Oh, I could scrub the place down, actually. Change clothes? Yeah. Going to work. Alright. Hello, mouse. Gato. Okie dokie. Well, let's see what's over here. It is dark outside. It show is. Oof. All right. Well, there's a nice bathroom I have here. Oh, the trash. It's a little overdue. Gotta bring flashlight. Cause it's that dark outside. Oh, yes, I'd love to pick up the flashlight. Oh, that door's not opening. Some steep stairs out of my apartment. I got no clue what this game's about. I need something changed. Oh, I need to eat something. That thing on my table? I thought I tried to. Can I eat it? Or is it something I must cook in the wave? Oh, hello. The shitter. <laughs> Anything f nice to eat? Guys, there's nothing to eat. Oh, well, thank you. I eat cook this, don't I? Yes, of course, warm it up, absolutely. Good microwave so far? <laughs> I'd love to eat the bento. Thank you. Oh, now that I've all, I've eaten all up. I've changed my clothes. I got a flashlight. I think I should be ready for work. Let me close my fridge door. Let me close all my other doors because it'd be rude to leave them open, right? But the outside sounds unwelcoming. Oh, of course I can run. Okay, I know the convenience store is right across the street. I thought I heard other footsteps for some reason. Oh, the convenience store is all the way over there, actually. These street lights do jack shit for this. Oh, that's falling down. I 
I'm taking the long way down. I'm sure there's no one lurking in these suburbs. I think that's what this is. I'm just gonna walk a little faster. <laughs> I wonder if I have like a sprint lock. Or oh, sprint cooldown. I'm gonna walk fast. That's all. Walk in the light. Oof. Feeling is very unnerving. Why is this little secluded suburb over there? Ah, look! It's the convenience store. <laughs> Just like in the name, this flashlight's pretty crappy on asphalt. There's a homeless dude. Maybe it looks like a worker, actually. I should probably not approach them. You know what? I'll approach them. Why do you look bizarre? I know what really happened here. I was called to warn you all. By the name I cannot speak of, the day of judgment will come. Hiya. Okie dokie. Hello. Thank you, Chris. Yeah, I'll give it a try. Cool. This shelf looks fine. Okay, well, I'm sure I need to talk to you, don't I? Oh, sorry. My, my bad, my bad. Oh, God, you made it. Hmm? Oh no, it's just that I recently heard someone had fell off the bridge you just crossed. What? There's an old lady that said she saw a man walking down the street with his legs completely bent the other way. Scary stuff. Yeah, that is a little spooky. Probably this was a true story. I'm sure it's not. Ha <laughs> ha! Sorry. Thanks. Yes, I'd love to enter the counter. Sorry. Oh, punch in. Probably a good idea, yeah. I'm gonna shut the door on you. <laughs> yeah. My punch card! This. Well, let me punch in first. No way I'm doing investigating when I'm off the clock. Oh no, hold on. Let me. Oh, that's what that punch in looks like. <laughs> like one of those old ass ones. I think some food will expire by the time you start your shift. Can you take it off the shelves for me? Your manager. Okay, sure. Check the CCTV though. Oh, looks like someone just entered the store. Oh no, my um, my other employee dude just left. That's all. Right. That must be his ride. Or maybe that's a customer. Can't see homeless dude with these cameras. Ugh, looks like I have a customer. Took me a long time to get off of that. Hello, sir. I hope you're having a good day. I'm sorry I'm signing this flashlight in your eyes. Right, yeah. I'm gonna walk around the store if you don't mind. Just check some things off. Looks like some are expired. Yeah, let's take the expired items. And put them where? In the trash? Do I need to... Spoil them off accordingly? Or do I just need to throw it out somewhere? Excuse me, sir. There's a little door back here, so let me give this a try. To the bin this goes. Yes, love to. There's a little police tape area over there. Ah, 
I'm sure it's fine. Back into my convenience store. Sorry to give you a rating, sir. Oh, and I left the stockroom door open. Am I an amateur? Is he at the counter or did he walk out with the goods? No, he's at the counter. Oh, what a good Samaritan. Don't worry, I'm coming to help. Hello. Thank you. Come again. I did that right. Right? Oh, is my thing lagging? Oh, only a little bit for some reason. My thing's actually lagging a little bit. How was I not catching that? Is it lagging? Is it, is, is it lagging as bad as I think it is? I don't think so. See you later, dude. Hold on. I want to check to see if there's any other expired foods on these counters. Or if that was all of them. Due diligence and all that. Ah, okay. Oh, I can only do one at a time. Hopefully no one comes into the... Uh, store while I'm trashing things. You know? Ah, I'm sure it'll be fine. I'm actually really getting real tense about this. Because... <sighs> Mood being set all weird like... Oh, is that a car I saw? I think I saw a car. Hello? And on top of it all, my shit is broken. Okay. Much better. Check the cameras for a second here. Day one at my new job at Five Nights. Oh, I can move the cameras a little bit. Only like up and down though. Oh, there's another car. It's a tr that's a whole ass truck. Oh, there's the dump back there that I was just at actually. I hear the truck. I just don't see the truck. Oh, he's coming in. Okay, hold on. I'm coming, I'm coming. Oh, sorry, my escape key. No. My escape key, like, screwed up. What's up? Kinda late for a delivery this time, huh? We recently incorporated this system exclusively for convenience stores that are open late at night. Oh, okay. Looks like this package is directly shipped to the store. Oh, and the name matches your tag. That's convenient. Shh, what if I said no? Now, if you see the package, I'm too curious. Take it home? No! No, we don't take it home. Why would I take it home? I'll leave it at the store. Why would they deliver a personal package to my place of work. See ya! <laughs> See ya later. I'm gonna leave it at the store. Unless it just won't let me go home. Unless I take the package home, which might be the case. <laughs> let me punch out. Nope. I'm taking it home. Oof. Thank God I didn't have to make the walk back home. Is it the next day already? Oh, what was the package? Okay, oh, is it DVD tape? I'll watch it while I read my favorite. Oh God, I guess I'll watch closely. Oh God, it's gonna show me it super close. What if it's just like a video of me? 
Oh, I think it might actually be a video of me. What the hell is that? That seemed like the place where the security tapes were, because, well, there were security tapes. I ate that up, didn't I? So I just have no comments about that, not even to myself. Sure. G Willigers. Back to work I go. Alright. Whoa. First night. That was terrifying. Why does it feel darker? It's a lot darker. I think I remember which way I go. Not that way. Ooh. Okay, this is actually a lot scarier than I thought it was gonna be. There's something about these graphics that just... Fuck with me. Mentally. Oh, the convenience store. I'm gonna sing because it's the only thing keeping me sane. You guys watch Game Changer? I really wanna watch Game Changer. I wanna like buy the subscription service and watch Game Changer. It seems like a good show to watch. Game changer just seems like a nice thing to watch. I think I am heading the right way. Game changer, game changer. I saw a clip on TikTok. Oh, there's the bridge. I saw a clip on TikTok about game changer. They were singing about a town called Mountport. I'm gonna pretend I'm in that town right now. Happens to be in Jap Japan. Oof. Oof. Some different music, at least. That was a stressful walk. Welcome. Hey, hey. Heard you reported the, the doors would open on their own. Yeah, they were doing that. We had a guy check the sensor. It seems like the wiring's were loose. Okay, well, I guess it makes sense. <laughs> Dude. Oh, you thought it was some sort of portal, guys? I see those on TV all the time, but they're all scripted. Ghosts aren't real, after all. Well, I won't be taking the trash out tonight, in fear of my life. I don't know if you know that. I'm gonna go punch in, because, I mean, you clearly just let yourself out last time, so I'll do the exact same thing this time. Let me read my notes. Saw some rats behind the store yesterday, so I must have left the garbage bin open. First person to see this note has to get rid of the rodents ASAP. There, your manager. There is no way you did not see this note, dude. I'm talking to you. You did not see that note? There's no shot you didn't see that note. That's Capacix Maximus. No. You know what? I'll let him go. Whatever. I don't want to clean the rats up. I think there's evil afoot. I think there is a poltergeist, after all. Oh, it's got a little achievement called security. Oh, it showed up, okay. Sometimes it doesn't show up. Whoa, 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 who are you? You see that, right? There's an old lady. Wow, they really did fuck up the bin. Alright, I'm gonna watch you closely. You know what? I think this is a perfect time, actually, to get the rats out. Because she's gonna take her sweet, precious time to even get in the dang building. I think it's a perfect time to get those rats. Okay, I feel like I have to now. Hey, shoot. What do you want me to do about it? Hey, use. Well. Oh. Hold on. An old.
old woman has entered my store. Oh, wait. Oh, rat poison. There's six rats out here. I think I saw one over here. I'll be with you in a moment, miss. This dude better watch out. I got rat spray. They're everywhere spying on me. I hate that's all the rats I see. Sorry. That's all I saw. I put it back? Not currently. Hello, ma'am. Are you finding everything to your liking? Don't mind me, just killing rats. You can just go ahead, do your thing. Any rats back here? Clearly I'm missing two rats. I just don't want to go that far back in this alley. Seems like the wrong thing to be doing. I wonder if homeless guy is back. Maybe he's the one torturing me, so maybe I shouldn't even try looking for him. I don't know how many like uses this has or how many rats I need to kill. What does that sound? You know, I'm taking it as uses. Fuck this shit. Did she go to the bathroom? <laughs> Fair enough. Hello, car. Sorry, I didn't mean to open the door for you, but take it as a courtesy. I'm gonna stand behind the guy. I feel safer behind here. You and me and this six inches of wood is all that helps, though. Hello? How may we help you? Oh, I dropped it. Sure. Hey, I'm in a hurry. Could you please fetch me five cans of beer and a pack of cigars? Hurry up. Okay. Five cans of beer and a pack of cigars. Jesus. Fuck. <sighs> I just muttered that under my breath. I'll get it for him. It's okay. Oh, just kidding. Oh, beer. I like the beer. We'll be back here. Okay, yeah. Here is your beer. Oh, I need two, one by one. Five cans of beer and then what did he ask for? <sighs> Ooh. Okay, dope. Yeah, so this all works out. I don't know why the beer was on the floor. I'm sure I got cigars behind the counter, right? There's no way they're in front. There we go. There you go. Good. Now scan. Yeah. Okay. Sure. Yes, sir. Crap. Thank you. He's a crap. He needed that shit pronto. Hello, lady. I hope you've done okay. Should I go talk to her? I'll go, I'll go talk to her. Well, if you're just gonna stand there, yeah, I am gonna go talk to you. Did you make a boom boom? Uh, uh, with Kin Kun. You know what Kin Kun is. Oh, I thought I heard his voice. This was my daughter's house. All oh, sad. What did you do? Oh. How dare you! What the fuck? Okay, well, you know what? You've had your fun. I'm about to go spray the toilet. I'm about to exercise it. Did you keep the toilet clean? Ah, you did, thank you. I feel like there's more rats outside, but I think I'll be okay. Two rats I just couldn't find. She's walking home. So, 
See you later. See you. Whoa. I saw that, you little rascal. You damn hooligan! Do it again! How dare you! Try it! Fucking try it! There must be more rats somewhere. I think I have to find those rats. I mean, I can just drop it in here. No, I can't. Let me see if I can't find the rest of these rats. Oh, well there's one. All done, all done. Whew. Okay. Oh man, I deserve a raise after that one. That was too spooky a job for me, manager. What's that? What's that? What's that? I heard that. Oh wait. Oh, that was the track again. Oh, I have a customer. Sure thing. Yeah. Well, actually, no. Maybe I do have another. Good to see you again. Well, you know, the unstoppable trend on altering everything online. Anyway, seems to be a package that needs to be picked up here. Picked up? Wait, picked up? Oh, this thing? Okay. Yes. See ya! I was gonna get another package. What the development that would have been. See you later, dude. And he's gone. No, about that. Not so scary after all. This is a pretty easy job, all in all. Once you get past the spooky part, easy job. Once you get past the possible stalker killer thing, getting some ring vibes. Can I go home? <laughs> I'm already spending an exceptionally long night in the convenience store. I can check the shelves, I guess. Oh, I hate the noises. Night, night. I'm gonna have to walk this fucking draining him. I gotta walk this fucking town again. Oh, I feel like I'm the only one. Actually, I take it back. Don't even pretend to let me know I'm not the only one. What? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Umbrella's not a bad idea. Oh, look at that. I'm gonna shine the fuck out of your face. Oh shit. It's another tape. Yes, let's watch closely.
What the hell is this? Noises in my ears that I don't like. Okay. I don't like the packages. Okay, we're gonna go outside. Oh, sing in the rain. Sing in the rain. It's a little lighter outside, at least. Sing in the rain. Lots of fun, not a lot of pain. Sing in the rain. That's how I enjoy it. It's been my day. Maybe with the rain, no one comes to the store today. But sing in the rain, sing in the rain. I feel like I'm hearing things. <clears throat> sing in the rain. I love singing in the rain. I hope I wake no one up with my singing in the rain. I'm sorry, I didn't want to hear that. But this is a coping mechanism, and I think I'll back actually. I'm gonna apologize for coping. The bridge that someone fell off of. Ooh, Ooh man. A little rainy today. That's quite alright. I hope my manager has not left me a note about going back outside to the back again. Oh, my good co worker friend. Who isn't here? What the freak? Not cool. <gasps> oh, he said boo. Got you good, huh? Yeah. Okay, okay. Fine, I'll stop. Probably just want to do it again. Well, I don't believe you. Yes, someone's been sending me VHS tapes. Sounds a perfect idea for a horror flick. I thought it was just a prank. Doubt anything. And come on, it's just a video. Okay, well then I'll fucking start sending you them and then you see how freaked out you get. The products were missing on the shelf. I always keep the shelves full. That's our motto. Please restock them by tomorrow morning. You manager. Thanks. I'm guessing you didn't do shit about that, did you? Punching in. See ya. Ah, oh, I can just go ahead and restart. Well, let, 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 me, let me check the CCTV. First and foremost. See, it's feeling a lot like the ring. I'm starting to think maybe I shouldn't be watching these videos. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh hell nah. That looked like the kid that was messing with the door. I'm not going outside. Nope, not once today am I going outside. It broke it down. You saw that, right? Oh. Fuck no. <laughs> that must be my coworker leaving. Oof. See you later. It's just kids playing around. Two scares in one day. Okay, it's probably restock. It's not like music is coming from out there, but. Hearing a lot of music today. Oh, I feel like they go here. Some 
product was missing. Fuck you, dude. Oh yeah, we stop. Clearly, I must have done it. Well, let's see if there's any more out there. Who cut the music off? Oh, fuck off. Fuck. Hey, I need someone's help. Guys. Hello. Someone came in. Who the fuck are you? Hello, sir. I'll be with you in just a moment. Hello. <sighs> Was it the you that locked my door? Hello, good sir. I'm Hamada. Hello, Hamada. You look like you've had a hard day at work. There's something wrong with the air conditioning. Ross seemed desperate in keeping the food fresh. Hey, if you're working this late, but it pays me well, you know. Don't mind me. I'll just quickly check the outside units and head right out, okay? You can do that! I know I've got more to restock, but I kind of want to watch him change this shit. The restock can wait. I know he's gonna go around back here. I feel like that's an air unit right there, right? Right here. Right below the camera. This is good. This is fine with me. Uh, because the air conditioning gets fixed. Uh, boss isn't angry. He gets paid. And I'm not the one that has to go out there. I almost went out there. Because I thought if that door locked, I'd have to go around the back. To get back to the front. Oh, look at him. He's, just, he's checking it. Imagine he just dies. <laughs> but it went out there, isn't it? Be careful with electricity and everything like that. Alright. He took one good look at it. I'm feeling very tense right now. Oh, who, who the who, 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 oh, no use. <sighs> Yellow, okay. Welcome to convenience store. I hope everything is to your liking. Hello, my air conditioner guy. You gonna walk back in here and tell me what the... Nope, you took one look and left, understood. That works, I guess. Hey, you want to stay in the store while I get some more stock? So I don't get locked back here again? My lady. Thank you. I just got these. Okay. These magazines or something? Hello, hello. Oops, sorry. Trying to restock some things here. Oh wait, up here, up here. Sorry, madam. I am here to help. Say ya. Hey. You the only one working here? Yes. I can't believe this. I have a man to put a girl on a midnight shift all alone. 
I don't know, the man my manager's can't be douche. So you have no choice. Yeah. Well, at the very least I'll give you my protection charm. Oh. Be careful. Yes, of course take it. A protection charm? Okay, my duties are done for the night. We close the door, we watch the cameras. Clear. I hate everything. Hate it all. I, mean, I very much hate everything about this. Since I'm done with my, I mean, I am done with my stock, right? I'll take one last look at it. It's gonna end the night. I thought someone came into the damn bathroom. Guys, what the heck? Oh crap. Uh uh. Yo! We trash the place. Are you for real? Excuse me, there's no one on the computer. that what was that what was that was this protection charm really a protection charm this car is passing outside it's raining outside where I'm at right now so this is I'm playing this like near goddamn near midnight but no why would i want to pick up the fucking talismans i guess i'll pick them up <laughs> oh my god that actually scared me i didn't think it I didn't think it'd jump scare me over again like that. Dear manager, quit. So this camera is just forever bugged out right now. Clearly, I can't clean up this goddamn mess. Like I want to. Like a good worker, after being traumatized. Oh man. I don't know what I'm gonna do with these. Don't tell me I gotta throw them away. I mean, do you hear that sound out there? I'm gonna have to fucking go outside.
what did you do to it? Fucking nothing. The wrench. Why did he stop fixing it? You want me to go, do you want me to go back there? Like back there? Like past the thing? Cause hell no. Fuck. Oh my god. I don't know if I can do that. <laughs> okay. I don't think I have a choice. Okay. Okay. Where's gonna go? Okay, you know what? No. We're okay. We're fucking okay, okay? Excuse my French. But, oh my god, are we okay? There's no way we're not okay. We've never been more okay in our damn life, okay? So what? God. Hello? To that house. I don't even know if they're open. Or is there something that's grabbing me? Alright, then I'm fucking out of here. Are you joking me? I got my little tarot things. I already forgot what they're called. Talismans or something? Don't be surprised if the demon get in. Although clearly doors being open don't fucking matter. I don't feel safe. But I feel safer when I'm behind the counter. Even if by a tiny bit. Do I need to bring the talismans over there? I don't have any other customers. This is just a normal convenience store night, apparently. This is what, my second night? As a worker, things ramped up quick. At least my third night. Tabby is my third. But they oh my god, that rain. They're counting as a second night. Oh my god, I can hardly look at the screen right now. There's a fucking bike here. I'm gonna use these. Exorcise the door. What the hell? Who the hell? Manager? Four. Fuck. Fuck. God, and on an empty stomach, no less. <laughs> and you want me to go back? <laughs> you want me to go back there? You want me to go back? <laughs> what a night! <laughs> was it all a dream? No, it wasn't a dream. Are you joking? Yes, of course, pick up the flashlight. All right. 
Back to work. I guess it was just all a dream. I have two fridges. Well. Oh my god. Tape three. That dude had the number four on his screen though. It looked like he was watching the tapes. Okay, I guess I'll watch it. Maybe I shouldn't watch it. Mm, god, I think I made a bad decision here. The hot house. Okay. <laughs> really progressed that story further, didn't it? Okay. What the fuck ever? Let's just go. I have a feeling I only have one more light night to live. Brush our little asses home, home to work. Because for some reason, you know, it's fine, it's whatever. This shit happens all the time. I hate walking through this town. That's fucking nuts, though. So the manager, he looked like the manager looked like he watched the tapes. Singing in the dark, my manager was pulled apart. Well, his eyes were, at least. I guess he didn't see that coming. Singing in the dark. What's my employee knows? Did I, did, I, did I tell no one about this? Or did I just wake up after that? Like, I saw that and I woke up in my room. That would happen. I don't know. Sounds like that homeless dude was right, though. Seemed like that air conditioner dude did jack shit, though. Singing in the dark. I hope that dude doesn't scare me again. Oh, he's not behind the counter, so I believe he's going to scare me again. Oh, just fucking kidding. He's just absent. <laughs> No note from the manager. No way to punch in. Is there any find, my dude? Oh shit! Hold on. Where's my dude? <laughs> Don't tell me you watch the VHS tapes. Oh well. Glad to know the camera's fixed. The door is open back there. Fuck. Is he gonna be at the outhouse now? Is he gonna be dead? Oh my fucking god. Nope. Just keep watching the cameras. Oh my god. The kid. My fucking... We're all out of whatever you're looking for. I don't know if you just heard it, by the way. But... I think my brother just got home. He's on spring break, so he's been staying out and doing stuff. I think my brother just got home. And he was opening and sh shutting the doors really loud for being for getting home at damn near midnight. <laughs> oh fuck. Don't do it, kid. Don't come behind the counter. Oh, thank you. My host, I avoid the kid. He's not gonna show me the outside. Yeah, whatever you think we have, we don't. Huh? 
See ya. Oh wait, no. What's a goal here? Am I just gonna have to avoid this goddamn kid? Anyway, my brother came home and it was scaring the hell out of me for just a second ago. Oh my god. I don't see the fucking kid though. Maybe I can only see them through the cameras. See ya. Just fucking kidding. Can't really see anything that's going on over here. Mic going. I have to go through the front door. It looks like none of the fucking above. <laughs> what am I supposed to do here? This might be a stupid idea. Let me not do that. Hold on. The TV screens up. Oh, what? Oh, Send up. What? So he's looking at the so the, one of the ones I didn't actually cut on. What if I try to cut that one on instead? Cause I don't think he's actually visible here. There's this one. That one's not exactly making any sound, but let's check if see if that like changes color or something. I don't know. Okay, he look. It looks like he's looking at specific monitors. <laughs> Alright, little dude, I'll play your damn game. Was it this one he looked at? I feel like he looked at. Oh no, I might have been this one. Oh. I think that is what I have to do. I think I just got the puzzle wrong. Cause I just turned on four of that last one. Four aisles, four televisions. <laughs> okay. He lo he's looking at this one. He's literally looking at this one. Even though this one does, even though the others don't make a sound, and that one doesn't make a sound. Uh. Let me just try it anyway. I'm relying too much on the sound, I think. You guys hear that? Scared me a little bit. Nope. Who's here? No one? Fuck you. You're not gonna let me behind the counter, please. Oh, what's this? 
bring home? No, I don't think that's a good idea at all. What? I guess I fucking have to. Four. That's what the two died at. Okay. Throw away? I throw it away. Ooh. What's this? Send it off to someone else. Oh, like that little chain email thing? This does feel like the ring. Well, I don't think throwing it away is going to get rid of it. I don't think playing it's a good idea, considering what happened to my manager. I feel like maybe the dude that was trying to give it to me was doing the same thing. Yeah, yes, I'm I'm sure. Oh god. Maybe ending 1. I was sickened by the whole situation. I sealed the VHS tape carefully inside to send it off to the sender. Fortunately, the sender's address was on the box. Oh, so return to sender. I was when I was done preparing to send it off, I felt my tense shoulders relax. Too much had happened in a short span. My mind couldn't keep up. I knew I had to rest, but I couldn't fall asleep. Everything about the store terrified me. Inevitably, I had to sit down on a chair to clear up my head. What I see was everything I witnessed even real. Although I was scared, I knew I had to know the truth. I wanted to know what happened and why. So I turned to the internet about the store. Whoa, I found a few old articles and forums talking about the location where the building was made. One comment on a strange forum stood out to me. It said there seemed to have been a, some gruesome killings at the property. I searched for the same user's co comments. In 2009, there was a case where there was a man who was the mainstay of the main family committed a murder-suicide. I determined to investigate the incident further. September 14th. The man killed his child with a kitchen knife while his wife was off at a grocery shopping at a local supermarket. When my wife came back, it said that she was killed in an extreme way, and then hung himself on the same day. They say that the woman was pregnant at the time of her death. The woman was killed with several nails punctured into her along with her child in the stomach. Oh, wow, that's... I wanted to throw up from the obscene images. I knew I had to continue. That's why there was nails on the floor. There was a guy that replied to the comment and said that he worked at the same place as him. According to him, the man was often harassed by his boss at work. He had complained to several colleagues, and on the day of the incident, it said that he had an emotionless face. Imagining what the family had gone through, depression and hatred to occupy my head. It was very painful. With tears in my eyes, I closed the internet gently and called the manager to talk about everything. I experienced it in a night shift and what I discovered. Here were the calls when I picked up. They were the same over and over again. I never received a phone call from Mr. Jose. Hozo? Franchise leader, who I'd never met. I had a bad feeling about it. So it wasn't a dream, right? Then, with serving grace, he said the manager is dead. Yeah, I thought so. I couldn't breathe, so it wasn't a dream. And when I asked about the place where it was found, Mr. Hozo said there was an old store at a convenience store. He was found there a day of his death. After a day of his death, I dropped my phone. Yeah, I quit my part time job with a broken feeling quitting I would avoid going near the convenience store whenever I could because every time I passed in front of the store I would always feel a sharp stare towards me and won't be able to help but to try and pass as quickly as possible so as not to look at the building. A day later the store had closed down. The reason seemed to be due to poor management but further details were not public in size. At that point I didn't have the means or the courage to examine it anymore. After a while the memories of the convenience store started to haze down a bit. One day, as I passed by the now closed down store, I heard a child's voice. There I saw the woman. When I looked in my hand, I picked up one of the rusted nails I had fallen in the middle of the site.
chill as I am. That's it. Oof! That was some crazy <laughs> tension. <laughs> very, very. It's a cup ramen label. Oh wow, look at that. I hated this. Not like as in it was a bad game. It was terrifying, I guess. So good job. <laughs> it was really scary. Um, I was interested in the story though. I, I, I was, I, I was very interested in what was going on. I just didn't know if I could make it through it. <laughs> Ending one. I wonder how many endings there are. I bet watching. I bet throwing away the tape gives you an ending. I bet. Um, I bet watching the tape gives you an ending. Thank you for playing. Thank you for making. <laughs> Hello. Okay, well, there it is. That's the convenience store. <laughs> I will never love a convenience store again. So I like, I like convenience stores at night to begin with, but that was a very, very nice little game. I really liked that a lot. Um, I feel like it could have gone faster if I worked through it faster, but I think I was a little bit fucking scared. <laughs> Um, either way, thank you guys for watching this. Um, again, I have some more horror indie games um, that I'm probably going to play through, um, including um, the... F I think it's called Faith. Yeah, Faith the Holy Trinity. Or either Faith the, Faith the Holy Trilogy or something like that. Either way, it's three games. Um, then I also have like Last Night in Vivo or something like that. And then I have like Iron Lung. And I don't know it any of those games is about i've seen the art style of faith um before I, I think i've seen it somewhere on the internet i, I feel like i've seen it uh but i don't know anything about the other ones i can't wait to get to them and i can't wait for you guys to get through them with me <laughs> thank you guys for watching i hope to see you in the next one bye, -bye.